So my microphone here is connected to the jack, but there is no audio coming in. A little bit of a problem that's been, uh, been kind of building up for the last couple weeks. Well, I think it's time that we send this bad boy in to get a little repair. Got it all boxed up. We are ready to roll and uh, not to the post office. Got our jet boil going right now. Got to get some water boiled. I think we got a little, little chicken and dumplings and beef strug on the on the menu tonight. So once the water boils, we'll be eating, hanging out by the fire, catching up, and then uh, getting ready uh, for the morning. morning. Fellas, how we feeling? A little sleepy. A little chilly. <laughs> we got the set up. Pretty pretty stoked for tomorrow. We got 5:30 a.m. Alarm. So. A little natural alarm, maybe the song come wakes up. Oh. That's full of money. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, Good I night, can't, you, can, you can't even see my eyes. <laughs> Universe, base camp. Base camp, I know. Start the day, boys. Switchbacks. Little shortcut, baby. Yee! We just got up here, found uh, kind of the stream that we were uh, we were looking for, and I'm telling you, this is this is some of the most pristine water that I've seen in North Carolina. Yeah, baby. <laughs> we about bump it. Let's go. Yeah, that's a good fish. Real Great good fish. fish. Shout out Carson Decker on the tie. A little sexy waltz. Damn, dude, look at the red on his dude. fins right there. You see that? Or the orange? Yeah, beautiful. Look at those blue spots, man. It's pretty. Dude, 
Yeah, buddy. An absolute behemoth. <laughs> We are probably about two and a half, three miles back, and we've been slaying it. And what I've learned is that Scotty fishing <laughs> Creek is kind of like Duke playing at Cameron Indoor Stadium. <laughs> it's just home field advantage, <laughs> it's unfair. <laughs> uh, so we've been trying to keep up, but it's been a blast. It's been a, an incredible day. We've got Appalachian Mountain Brewing. A local beer. A little local IPA. We've got a little makeshift cooler here. Chaz has got a mick. <laughs> <laughs> Keep For Charlie, we're, we're keeping it classy. Look, we got some caddis coming off. I, I like to think it's caddis. I think it, every dry fly, every fly I see, I'm like, We caddis. think every fly is either a caddis <laughs> or a mayfly. Oh, man. Oh, like, man. <laughs> oh, God. This is an absolute <laughs> This thing is just bleeding. <laughs> we need a quick taste test. So, and I'm a tough grader. <laughs> Seven, seven and a half. Seven and a half. Seven and a half. I, a half is kind of a, a rookie grade to give, but seven and a half. It's seven and a half. It's very good. You did make them. <laughs> so I feel like you're a little biased. <laughs> yeah. You made them? There's no you bias here. <laughs> seven so he and a half. <laughs> really good though. We're fueled up, ready to go. Ready to rock. Shucks hooked up. Yeah, buddy. So the one nice thing about filming with a GoPro is uh, when your buddy's on the other side of the stream, you can just toss the camera across. Yep. So you know it's a good day when you haven't yeah. switched flies all day and yeah. you've just been slaying them. Money. Let's see what fins and feathers has for us. Yeah. <laughs> I'm thinking right here though. Ooh. Oh, look the drive. Oh. Ah, wiped at it again. So I think the main takeaway from all of this, uh, shooting with just the GoPro, is although you might not always have the best thing, you might not have the biggest, the best, the newest, uh, you can still go out and create videos. You can enjoy the process of putting together videos. And I think hopefully what you guys can take away from this is, is don't let your resources limit you. No matter if it's your fly gear, no matter if it's your film gear, no matter what it is, I think the most important thing is just to get out and do it. And I mean that about fishing and I mean that about filming. I started filming off a of GoPro and I started fishing with my cousins who I'm fishing with today. And so it's been a really, uh, almost like a nostalgic feel today. Just first cast. Let's go, dude. <laughs> first cast. Oh, no. no. Just the exploration factor of getting out and finding a new stream and just checking it out and only having just this GoPro to kind of share our story and share what we're doing today. But I think it's kind of reminded me that no matter what, it's so important just to get outside Go fish, enjoy the river, enjoy fishing with good people, and make the most of whatever you're doing that day. Oh, you missed. Oh, <laughs> I was patient the first time. I know you were, dude. You hit it three times. We had an awesome day up here. This stream was killer. I mean, we all caught so many fish. 
it's great to fish with these guys. Like I said earlier, you know, growing up fishing with Chuck and Adam and to have them come up from Charlotte and, and kind of show them around. And we, you know, we got to explore a new stream together, which was uh, just kick ass. So any guys watching, I know a lot of times it's easy to, to just want to know the exact spot, the exact fly. You want to know everything about, you know, the place you're going to go and how you're going to fish it. But sometimes it takes just a little bit of exploring, getting off the beaten path, you know, putting in a little extra work and finding a stream like this. I mean, we didn't see one other fisherman today. So in my book, that is a big win. So before I end this video, I've got a big announcement that I want to share with you guys. Uh, over the last few months, I've been working really hard to kind of put something together and it is finally ready. Uh, what I'm talking about is our new and improved 2020 summer apparel line, the Daybreak Collection. This is by far the biggest apparel launch that we have done to date and definitely my favorite gear that we've released to you guys. My talented friend Chelsea did all of the new designs for the apparel and I'm telling you like she knocked it out of the park. Like this stuff is so sick. She crushed it. It's it's so awesome. You have, you have to check it out. So this apparel line is a great way for you guys to support the channel, to help it grow so we can do bigger and better projects, bigger productions, and really just push the limits on the videos that we're making. Because I wanna bring the best quality videos possible to you guys and more videos. And this is a great way for you guys to really help make that happen. So if you're interested, swing over to www.wild-fly.com shop. I will leave the link somewhere down in the description. The first two weeks, I'm gonna be running a pre-order and basically when you order, you will receive your item on like a normal shipping day, which is like maybe three to seven days. You'll receive it in like two weeks. And that's just because of COVID right now. There's, there's a big delay with shipping and production, everything right now. So just bear with me. But if you do order within that two week period, I'm running a little bit of a sale. If you use the code wildfly10, you will get 10% off your entire order. So make sure you go out, take advantage of that and get you some fresh gear for the summer. There's a ton of different options. There's a ton of different gear. So hopefully there's at least something on there for you. Uh, but definitely go take advantage of that 10% here in the first two weeks. And thank you guys so, so much for all of your support. These videos would not be possible if it wasn't for you, for you guys tuning in and watching and sharing my videos. So I, I really do appreciate that. Thank you for watching this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it and we will see you in the next one.